one of the things that many people face is loss and yes. grief. And many times we don't talk enough about the emotional component. Definitely. We talk about the crying. We talk about the missing. Yeah. But there are all kinds of after effects it's a that lot. it has. Sometimes I, do, I, I can be wondering how, much, how deep you want me to go because I'm a very, very deep human being. Yeah, I want to hear. Okay, so, uh, okay, the thing is, now, when I lost my mom, yeah, mm. as I said, I lost my mother, my dad lost a wife. Mm. My dad now, he, I feel like we both, in our own way, felt like, just, it's just, it's just me judging over my head, you know? I felt like both of us, didn't like do enough when she was alive. Like I feel like personally myself, I didn't do enough. You know, I was just we were just about to start celebrating my mom. She was 49. Right. You get it was the first time I was gonna ever buy her a gift. Mm -hmm. Do you get me? I was, I was just this spoiled boy. So I was planning to okay, her 50th birthday is coming up, let me get an artwork for her. I was gonna commission someone, you know, to get an artwork for her. So she was we're about to move to our big house, you know, everything was about to get good. We're about to start spoiling her. Do you get me? And then she moves on. So I'm now in the position where I'm, I'm almost regretting mm. not doing none of those things to her. Ah. I feel my father also felt that. So he was very hurt. Yeah. Ah, my dad was. My dad is a man, like full brute. So he's brute, you know. So he was. He was always crying. Yeah. You get. So I had to even be the man sometimes after that initial period. Mm. Because both of us cannot be crying now. <laughs> Do you understand? <laughs> yeah. You know. So he was hurt. He was deep. So for him. He also would sometimes look at me and then be reminded of her, because we are very similar. Right. So it really caused a that kind of rift. Right. So first there was guilt yes. about, oh, this one had been so present for you guys. Yes. And you were enjoying the love. It was yes. after she had gone and realized, oh my God, we just wanted to start you. doing things for her. Exactly. And then there was the hurt as well that your dad didn't know how to navigate. Yes, even myself. So both yes. of us were just... Butting heads. I'm telling you. I started becoming more independent. My father now started to understand me better, because right. now he can see me. You know, he's so it wasn't conversations that led to that. It was as you were doing things, he was seeing you. Yeah, be he was seeing me being myself. You know, and what now kind of actually made it? Although the relationship was already getting really good, right. because he was seeing me be my own man. That's actually what he has always wanted. Right. But then when I now went for Big Brother, he now actually watched me. Uh, you understand? So right. that really cemented the relationship. I don't know okay. what about the show. Since I came out, we've barely fought. We barely had any issues. We're always okay. gisting. Mm. You know, so because for the first time he has sat down and he has and watched, watched me. You. So he was—that means he was proud of the man he saw on the show. Definitely, definitely, he was. So we Surprisingly, surprisingly, <laughs> surprisingly <laughs> nobody is there talking their own. Yes, and this man who you grew up knowing as a man's man. I'm telling you, as a brute. My father is full brute. <laughs> Bruto, <laughs> ah, my father is my father does not show emotion. No. Yes. Ah, he's full brutal. Now he's soft now, but then hey, my father that will tell you, do see, go call me daddy, call me sir. <laughs> I get you now. Yeah. I get you. Yeah. You so now we're all we're all good now. But the thing that made them call you Momo in the house. Yes. You know, was you emoted very you were you emotion they say you were emotional. Yes. Yeah. They, yeah. they say I was following woman. You were following woman, yeah. you know. Why were you following woman? This is two years after. <laughs> yes. Because what I, and the important part of yeah. not even the specifics is, yeah. is, was that the kind of person you were before you got into That's the house? That's who I am. Right. That's who I am. It's not even matter of where or was or <laughs> That's who to be. That. Yeah. That's who I am. Yeah. You saw... So, so in the I house like, wasn't strange for you to it be. It wasn't strange. But you know, the thing is, when you're in the house, the... The crew, the camera, the, di the director, all of them, we kind of set the narrative. Yes, they're looking for story. They're looking for story, they're looking for yes. content. You can't blame them now, I understand. You know, so they kind of make it look a certain way. Whatever you're doing, they blew it up. When you see that it's quality content. Everybody's a lover boy. All of us are all lover boys. All these guys behind the camera. You know, you, I'm sure you're a lover boy to your wife or yeah. your girlfriend. You know, everything. Yeah. yeah. So, so that's I think it was a bit exaggerated, of course. I'm, I'm extreme. <laughs> I wouldn't blame them completely. <laughs> so you say you're good at your extreme. I agree. <laughs> I agree. Yeah, yeah. But then it's still a human thing. You know, it's not like I committed any crime. Yes, of course. I followed one woman. <laughs> as it should I be. I said as it should be. Do you understand and me? What's the challenge? Yeah. What's the challenge? <laughs> but I blame myself the most, Sha. Right. Most people cried under the sheets. Me, I went outside. I sat down in the bang bar. I look at the camera and this is like rain. Proper music, everything in the background. <laughs> I love it. This is like selling just. I tell you, I'm a very dramatic woman, you know. I could have cried that in all my shit, nobody even know. But I went outside. Yes. I wore hood, I put toothpick, glasses, <laughs> full, full set up. <laughs> Big Brother is still the biggest TV show on the, the continent. Biggest. Yeah. But you know, it has gained a reputation for creating toxicity. Ah, no. 
agree. I agree. housemates, with fans, between fans. I just didn't last for years. Yeah. Like, you know, when I do big video ah, interviews, yes. I post it on my page. I feel like, I feel like, oh, when I posted something about Lekon last year, and somebody like, what you did to her? I'm like, yeah. even Lekon has forgotten what he did to her. <laughs> Yeah. So how do you? It never goes away. It never goes away. They hold, and I think you're right. I think it's because people are tailored to the people, so I'm it's personal, you, it's for, personal. It's personal. It's personal for them. It's not about the person. It's about personal. Yeah. You know, for me, when it came out, ah, what's going on? <laughs> what's going on here? You know, so what I just did was I just kind of like rebranded it to Lover Boy. Right. Do you get me? So I just owned it. And I guess you know I didn't watch the show. What was no movie? problem. They say mumu mumu. Mumu, right? Because of the yeah. way you were in the house. Exactly. Yes, yes, you know, yes, so yes. I was really. I didn't think you could be that bad, you know. <laughs> <laughs> when I was in the house, you know, I, I figured, okay, some people might not like it. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But I didn't think you would be that bad. Come just on. Just thought just move on. Yes, like, now. To become a, a, yes. a, 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 I was just a, being human. Yeah. Thank you for joining our YouTube channel. I know, I hope um, you loved that video and you connected with it. Don't forget. Please subscribe, please like, please share with your friends and family, please comment. We love to see your comments and to see the full versions, join our community right now or past episodes on watch.withtoday.com. Let's be human.